What's up YouTube, Marvin Four here with Great American Survival and in today's episode we are going to be testing out the time limit on the Yuko Sweet Fire Strikeable Fire Starter. These things are incredible, they claim they'll go for 7 minutes, we're going to crack them open, we're going to bust out the timer and we're going to see how they do. Hope you'll stick with us, we'll tell you all about it. So as you see, we're gonna get started. Quick, easy strike. Move that over there. Turn this around like that. And we're gonna let this run and see how long it goes. Just burning. Now, what I really like about these is, as you see, this is how it's gonna come in the box. Box of 20, made of recycled material, renewable biofuel, burns for seven minutes each. Nice, I love the fact that it's got the built-in strikers, comes with 20 and two separate little packages. Very nice. What's it say? Made from sugarcane. Fibrous sugarcane byproduct for renewable biofuel. I like that. Now I've been using this. This is like my probably my third box. I've used these a lot with my um, like my fire, my little uh, solo stoves. Anytime where I'm starting tinder, you keep a pack of these in there, and you got 20 fires. Uh, easy to use, easy to start, work great, and um, I can't say enough about them. They're really easy, they're really cool, and the cost is great. You know, for less than 10 bucks, you get a pack of these. They work great. That's how they're going to come. They come in two little packs of 10. And then all you're going to do is open them up, break one off, pull it away, like so, and then just strike it on the side. And I will say, try to keep this in a waterproof container because this, these right here, here hold on, let me show you. This is one of my old ones and it got wet and it is absolutely useless. Uh, not gonna start anything on anything. I mean, just awful. Uh, the box is just completely, this box is dry now, but once it got wet, useless. So if you're gonna buy a box of these, keep them in something. Keep them in a Ziploc bag or whatever it might be on your trips. Because if you end up dumping it in the river or you get rained on, you don't want the package to get wet. Or if you do, just keep a small piece of sandpaper or something else you can strike, and that'll work. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to fast forward through time to the end of this video so you guys can see how long these last. Here we are at just under seven minutes, and they say that they burn for seven minutes, so well over, it lived up to its promise, let's say. I think that's pretty cool. I like a product that works. These, now usually if you can't get a fire going in seven minutes uh, with your tinder, one, it's gonna be really saturated, really wet, um, but this still works to help you get your fire started. It has worked great in the past. I've used it on many, many camp stoves, and it just works. Here we are at over seven minutes. I will fast forward to the end and let you see how long it does go before it completely goes out. So even here, here we are at almost nine minutes. Nice, it's still got a breeze blowing here tonight. This is impressive. I'm really happy with this product. Like I said, we've been using them for a while, but this is two minutes past what it's supposed to, what they advertise. As you see, it's starting to really smoke. That's because it's running out of fuel. And guys, that's impressive. Well, I'm gonna back out here. That's, you see, nine minutes, we're good to go. Nice. So as you see, this is rolling in 10 minutes. Let's see what it is. I wanted to see what it was. Let's 
Still got a nice little coal going, you know, but it's just a biofuel. Not bad. I used my spoon from dinner. Wanted to make sure I used it just to break it up. I wanted to see what's really in there and how it looks. That's actually still a good coal. You know, so if you were still using it, you ten and a half minutes. That's gonna do it. We're gonna back out after this. Well, now that is the remnants. That's what we have left, a little bit of ash from the biofuel. This thing worked great. As you saw, the results were much better than what we had expected. They claimed seven minutes and these things went well past that. I say they easily deserve a full blown thumbs up. They belong in, if you're looking at building yourself a reliable bug out bag or some type of go bag, or just a winter survival bag for your car, this is an easy no-brainer that this works. Guys, if, you're ha if you have products like this that you'd like us to review, tell us all about it. Tell us in the comments down below products like this that you'd like us to test. Or if you're with a company that has products like this that you'd like us to test, please email us at greatamericansurvival at gmail.com and we will test them out and we will let everybody know what we think about them. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you're new to our channel, please hit the like button and click the subscribe if you're new. We would love to hear from you. Guys, we have a great time. If you haven't gotten in on any of our giveaways, please check out our other videos. We've got a few giveaways going on. Thank you so much for being part of this community. I hope if you guys are like us, you're getting outdoors and enjoying nature and having a great year. The year is coming to an end here as we close out December of 2019. And we want to thank you all for being part of it. We couldn't do it without you. We look forward to the year and the next year of 2020, and we thank you in advance for all you do. Thank you guys so much. We look forward to it. We hope you guys get out there. You enjoy yourself. You enjoy nature. You be prepared and stay safe. God bless, guys. We'll see you soon.